this is our ninja ready so what we have to do now is get him off the plastic so he can dry completely he's dry enough to remove from the plastic so just where the sticky tape is cut it off all right so you can move it around a bit on the top Okay, now, might be able to seem a bit better if he's like that off the board. So there's our ninja. So that's what we're going to put onto the cake so we can just fill it in with our Dream Whip icing, which will be coloured. Okay, so what we have to do is slowly go around and take the pipe don't paint off the plastic. Now this is black pipe don't paint, black one. And this has been in the oven on light and fan since this morning. So it just shows you how quickly the oven can dry this product out if you're in a hurry to use it. So it's just a matter of, sorry you can't see, going backwards and forwards with the knife to get the pipe don't paint off. Because this will help to dry the underneath once it's lifted off as well. And we want to try and keep it in one piece which shouldn't be a problem. thing you ever use this product for is to do this on your cakes then it will save you time because normally you would have to work out a way once your cakes got icing on it as to how to transfer the picture over onto the cake and unless you have an overhead projector sitting by in your back room or whatever it can get quite difficult to do Otherwise, a lot of people do it freehand. You could use chocolate, as I mentioned earlier, but in the process of using chocolate, you might have a hot day where it melts or anything could happen, and it also might not be the colour you want. For me, I'm lucky I wanted black for my ninja because he's black and green, whereas we have quite a lot of colours in the colour range for Pipe Don't Paint. So it's just a matter of finding the colour that you want, or you buy the clear and you can mix it up yourself to the colour that you want. Our mixing instructions are also on our website, DVD instructions as well as worded instructions. Now these bits that weren't connected I'm keeping because I still I can stick them on in the spots they need to be stuck on. So you do have to do this rather gently but not as intricately and carefully as a royal icing filigree or a chocolate filigree for that fact. This bit might not be as dry because it's a little bit thicker. And the idea is once we've lifted it off, the air will be able to get to underneath the plastic and completely dry it out hard. So we just have to lift it up like a piece of chocolate onto our cake.
okay. Basically the ninja's been completely lifted. So it's just a matter of once our cake's ready, we'll put him onto our cake and then we'll go from there. I did slice in a few little spots because the knife was very, very sharp. So yeah, basically just that's all we need to do. We'll leave it and then in a few, little while I'll show you how to put him onto the cake.